Good afternoon, this is Mrs. Black Gold, and I'm coming to you with a hump day happy hour Dollar Tree haul. Happy hour is a state of mind, so we're going to get this haul done early in the day, because I believe it's about maybe close to 12 o'clock right now. Um, we're getting ready to be 12 o'clock in the afternoon. So I neglected to show you a whole bag of items yesterday that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. Um, you know how it is. You get out the car. You think you have them all. You don't. Or in my case, I've told the boys to get the bags. And I thought they brought them all in and they didn't. So let me show you what I have. Um, as well as I always do this with the refrigerated and frozen items. I get them into the refrigerator really quick. I say I'm going to pull them out to show you and I forget. So let me show you these items as well. This is a repurchase, the Falani Texas Toast Garlic Toast. You get six thick slices. I've picked this up before. The boys love it. It's a, a delicious to have with pasta night, whenever. You could be having chicken or something. Just the Texas Toast is good. Um, and I also picked up a four pack of the Danimal Strawberry Yogurt. Is it just strawberry? Yep, all four packs of strawberry. They have a date on here of November 1st, 2017. So I thought that was great. Um, and they are four ounce containers of the Danimals. So for a dollar, this is really good. I'm not sure if in the grocery store you get maybe like an eight pack, but it's probably still three or four dollars for an eight pack. Okay, so let me show you the bag I missed yesterday. Now, um, due to Only In My Dreams, I remember seeing her hold this. It was the Honey Vanilla, and she talked about how good it was, and I've purchased the Honey Vanilla. I'm using that now um, in my half bath, and I love it. I love the consistency of it. Um, it's not that it's a moisturizing, I guess I should say, like hand soap, but it's thick. It has a thickness to it, so um, it doesn't feel runny. You feel like you're really you know, cleansing your hands. So I wanted to try the Sweet Pea Blossom. Um, again, I've only purchased the Honey Vanilla, and this is a 14-ounce container. And I hope I'm saying that right. I think the scent was Honey Vanilla. Um, but I have, I picked up this Sweet Pea Blossom in Baltimore because I haven't seen this here. If they've had it, if they've had it, it's, you know, gone quickly. And then I also picked up this Renews It Blissful Apple, Apple and Cinnamon um, Gel Air Freshener just because it's in the pink, you know, for breast cancer awareness, which is this month of October. And it just says hope for a cure. And these solid gel air fresheners are seven ounces. All right, so the other items I forgot to show you from Baltimore were these Kiss Gel nail polishes. This is the Kiss Gel Strong. Um, like I'd say maybe a month or so ago, we were getting some and then they all of a sudden were gone. Maybe I just missed out on some colors. Um, but this is a repurchase. I didn't know if I had this one. I picked up Maybe Me. I already have it. So you know that gets put aside for a giveaway. But I did pick up this Kiss Gel in what's called Eye Contact. That's the color of that. Then this is Inside Out. That's that beautiful purple. This one is called This Romance. That's a beautiful green. I love that. This one is called um, Pit-a-Pat. Kind of like a maybe darkish gray. Um, maybe like you might think it's like a purple too. This one is called Fall-ing. So F-A-L-L hyphen I-N-G. Really pretty. Really beautiful. Beautiful color. This one is called Subtleness. Okay. So I picked those up as well yesterday from out in Baltimore. And I've already checked. I didn't have any of those except the Maybe Me. So today I go into the Dollar Tree because I needed packaging. I needed to pick up um, stuff to send out all these giveaways. So let me show you. I picked up three of these mail pack envelopes. They're like bubble. They're called X-Pack, the ultimate mailer. And they're 10.25 inch by 15 inch so I grabbed four of these and then I also grabbed some just 3M bubble mailers two pack which are the six inch by nine inch so I picked up two of those and I was getting ready to leave the store and I was like uh you need to check and see if they have anything you haven't seen and they did really surprised oh I picked up another double didn't know I had it. Forgot that soon from buying it yesterday. So I picked up Inside Out again. So we'll put that to the side for a giveaway. Um, 
Oh, I picked up this romance again. Okay, I was lunching today. I picked this up again. This romance giveaway. Okay, so, but I do have five colors that I didn't see before. And this is Habit. This is Feminine. That beautiful pink. This is That Moment. Look at that blue. That's nice. This is called Mood Today. And then last, this is called Routine. A little nice purple. Okay, so I have picked up those Kiss Gel nail polishes and I need to use them. You've been seeing my nails in these past hauls and giveaways and they look horrible. So the Dollar Tree also had a new item I hadn't seen before, which are these McCormick uh, recipe and seasoning mixes. There was only one I did not choose today, and let me show you all four. So I picked these up, and the only one I did not pick up today was the chicken tortilla soup. I am just not a chicken tortilla soup eater, never geared towards that. But I picked up, and the, uh, two of them are slow cookers. So the two McCormick slow cookers, and they say these all say limited edition. They all, no, not, they're not all the same ounce, but this 1.23 ounce slow cooker by McCormick is tomato, basil, chicken, and vegetables recipe and seasoning mix. This slow cooker shepherd's pie is a recipe and seasoning mix. It's 1.48 ounces. Then there are two oven roasted, which this sounds really good. Mediterranean cauliflower recipe and seasoning mix, which is 0.84 ounces. And then this oven roasted vegetable bruschetta recipe and seasoning mix, which is the same 0.84 ounces. So I love cauliflower. So we'll see about that one. Let's see what else I grabbed. Got some repurchases. But let me talk to you about this quickly. So I actually cooked this this morning for the boys. And this is Martha White Strawberry Muffin Mix. They enjoyed it. They really liked it. Um, but I used my muffin cups. I didn't spray the muffin um, pan. I actually used paper cups. Am I supposed to spray the paper cups too? Because the paper baking cups. Because my muffins got stuck in those. So let me know. Because they love these. And I will be making this um, Martha White Strawberry Muffin Mix again. Because all you have to do is add milk. Awesome. So another new item I found is the Betty Crocker Chewy Oat Bars Mix. And this is in Coconut White Chip. It says it bakes in 18 minutes in an 8x8 pan, and this is a 13.75 ounce bag. So it's like an oatmeal bar, you know, oatmeal kind of like brownie, but coconut white chip. Let's see if I have anything else. Um, and then just to kind of show you in comparison, I did pick up this package of Idaho and original mashed potatoes. Look for this bigger bag, you all. This is the 6.2 ounce bag. I figured I could always add my own cheese, bacon bits, whatever to this, chives. But then I picked up this also, this Idaho and loaded baked, baked mashed potatoes. This is a four ounce container and this one is 100% real Idaho potatoes blended with sour cream, cheese, onion, and chives with a taste of butter and bacon. So this is one that I wouldn't have to doctor up. But look at the comparison of the two bags. So as you can see, one is bigger than the other. So check them out. And then the last item I picked up that I haven't tried before, because I already tried the mango chili lime in these Harvest Snaps, the lentil bean tomato basil, which is a 1.6 ounce bag. And then this is the Harvest Snaps um, flavored green pea crisp and black pepper, which is 1.75 ounce. So the mango chili lime were good. I like those. The black pepper and tomato basil I haven't tried yet. And I believe that Lala from Lala's Land has already done a taste test on these. So check hers out. I remember being out today and seeing it come through. And these might be the healthy-ish snack she's talking about. I recall her saying on a Dollar Tree haul that she was going to do a taste test on these. So check out Lala from Lala's Land. Um, and you all, that's everything. Thank you for tuning into my Dollar Tree haul. Happy Wednesday. I hope you're having a great Wednesday on purpose. If not, make it a great day. Um, but I'll be talking to you very soon. Let me go get my yogurt and my Texas toast back in the refrigerator. And stay tuned for a couple pics from LA Colors. Um, had a bunch of nice little palettes of eyeshadows um, and a bunch of little things that I took pictures of. So you'll see those very soon. Everybody take care. Have a good day.
Time to play a little disco. 